What's up dudes? Paris here again, another tutorial, though this one is going to be a very quick short one. Um, I really should have put this in my M.2 Actors tutorial, but I wasn't thinking when I made that, so when oh. I um, mentioned in that video that I could only get PB Sprint to work, the animation, um, that was for a very obvious reason that I should have known, but I didn't, and I'll do better in my next one, don't worry. I won't leave anything out of my next tutorial, because that one's single player animations, and that one's coming soon. I promise. <laughs> Alright, so we'll just jump straight into this. So, assuming you've watched my first M.2 Actors uh, tutorial, you should have all all the setup, your React setup and all that stuff. So if you go to your folder where you've saved the game and all that good stuff, right? You go into the mods, and that is where you'll find that cinematic mod that I gave you guys last video. So you want to open that up, and you got a, a bunch of scary stuff here, which is fine. Um, so it's all about this pre-cache here. So you open up the pre-cache. It might look a little bit different. I've tried to clean one up a little bit for you, but yours might not have the the pre-cache MP anim or pre-cache model down the bottom there. Um, I'll have stuff in the description for you guys to copy and paste to make it a lot easier for you. Um, and this is where you basically import your animations and models that you want, and it'll load them up when you load the game, basically. Um, and if I miss anything, if anyone knows more about this and I missed something, please drop in the dis uh, in a comment for uh, the people watching this trying to learn. Alright, so we'll get into this. So you have uh, all these animations here. All of these animations. I'm pretty sure most of them will work. And I know there is a chicken dance one that I want to use this one. The chicken dance. Alright? So we're going to try and see if we can get the chicken dance to work. Because that's, that's fucking awesome. So what you want to do is you will have these uh, slick gamer commands right here. Alright? And we'll uh, just copy and paste. Everything in the description too. This whole list will be in the description. And we'll just pop that there. Multiplayer and um, chicken dance. You know, we'll do another one. I want to. I want to add a couple of uh, animations. So we'll just copy and paste that like that, and we'll do pistol run fast. Or we'll do. Uh, we'll do. Uh, yeah, we'll do PB pistol run fast. And we'll see if that works. And we'll just paste that here like so. Bang. And I don't need to pre-cache any models because we're just doing animations. The models are more or less for the single player part. Because doing single player animations is pretty much the same as this. But wait for my tutorial. <laughs> so you want to make sure you've saved this. And also these um, notepads and codes and whatnot can be quite sensitive. So make sure that there's no extra spaces. You know, you're all looking, you're looking clean and shit. You can't go across or anything. So I'm, I'm looking good here. I'm looking good. So we'll save that. We'll exit out of this, and we'll leave that open, because maybe we'll do another animation. And we'll um, exit out of this. Oh, actually, we you need to keep this open, because you, you're going to need to copy and paste these commands here. So we'll leave the pre-cache open, and we'll close that, and then we'll get straight into uh, IW4M. Let's do it. Alright, so we're going to drink, man. Go, go to get some of that green drink in you. Uh, what is that? That green drink, bruh. Delicious. Hopefully I'll be editing this video too, so there'll be some funny shit going on. Pussy! Hopefully. <laughs> I can't get quite lazy, I'm not gonna lie. Alright. Uh, quick shout out to all the boys who um, came and joined my stream today while I was editing the um, Devil Claim the Crown. Um, Team Taj. Shout out to all you boys, you, all you boys are amazing. Um, so we'll go on Afghan, just like we did with the uh, first tutorial, and we'll... Uh, just get into it. Only a little bit of fucking around. Just the way I like it. Just a little bit of fucking around. So hopefully this loads up nice and quick for us. I'm hoping this tutorial will be under 10 minutes long. I'm aiming for like 6 or 7 minutes. I want it to be nice and quick for you guys. Especially for you boys that already know how to spawn in the actors and all that stuff. And you're just wanting to learn how to get more animations. This will be perfect for, um, for you. Um, I always choose allies. Just a weird habit. Um... Jam this, and of course, I can't stand this FOV, so we're just going to change the FOV to like 90. There we go. Alright, we'll just no clip all the way over to a nice flat spot where we can uh, have a good look at our actors. Alright, so, assuming you've watched my um, previous actor video, you, I won't really need to explain what I'm doing here because I'm just spawning in the actors. I might even cut this out during the editor. Ah! Alright. Now, we want to add an animation to him, and remember the chicken dance that we got? He probably doesn't need a gun for the chicken dance, but you know, we'll try it anyway. Um, so we'll go actor, enum, actor one, and we'll see if the chicken dance works, eh? Um, so what we need is our pre-cache. Bring up pre-cache, and like, wee -ew. chicken dance. There you go, just copy this, and just paste it here, and hopefully it does something. Okay, so 
I think that this animation is not meant to be applied to um, human models, maybe, or something. Because um, he doesn't look too happy about that. <laughs> that don't look like a chicken dance to me. So we'll try the other one. Hopefully he's not just stuck there like that, but there's one way to find out. There we go. Uh, I put a whole bag of jelly beans up my ass. That's a pretty nice pistol he's got, but yep, see here's some other animations for you. And that's basically how you get other animations. Uh, if you have any questions or any problems, feel free to message me on Twitter or drop a comment. Like I said, if I'm not sleeping, I'm usually on my setup working hard. Um, so I should reply pretty quickly. And honestly, this guy... If he can hold a sniper like that, I would not mess with him. <laughs> no, but wanting to keep this sweet and short, um, thank you guys so much for watching. And again, any problems, just hit me up, get in contact with me in some way. I always enjoy helping people figure things out. Um, and that's how you do that. My name is Paris, thank you guys for watching.